We still have to show this in humans, but we're very excited about the mechanism. And so there are a number of ways that probiotic organisms actually help help the host. And the last one is an anti-inflammatory effect. So if you have a condition where there's inflammation, inflammation causes pain, discomfort, discharge, you would like the probiotic to, to bring down the inflammation. And we've now done one study which has been published in 2007 showing in uh, when you supplement lactobacilli rhamnosus GR1 and lactobacillus roitri RC14 into yogurt product, you can reduce inflammation, even severe inflammation in, in the intestine. And uh, Dr. Sung Kim published in 2006 a very nice paper showing the mechanism where the lactobacillus GR1 strain brings down inflammation. And so we can tell you that there are anti-inflammatory components. However, don't think of this as always needing anti-inflammation. In order for the body to fight infection, it actually has to bring up some inflammation. And there's a difference between inflammation that fights infection and inflammation that causes discharge and harm to the host. And so these organisms are very clever and they find a way to modulate the environment such that you don't get this, the same degree of damaging inflammation, but you still have the body fight off the